Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 15 box Lake Show Basketball Mixer. It's called the Lake Show Basketball Mixer because we're giving away some of these slabs right here. Uh, three legendary Lakers and a current Laker, LeBron James in his Cavs gear. Here's the list of boxes right here. Some really nice stuff potentially here as well. Let's do it. Oh, and if you bought a full spot, you got a chance to win a full spot. So let's go to the list here. Let's gather everybody's names up to there. The cereal box guys don't count. And then right down to there. All right, so then I'll gather all the names right here. So when you sold 19 spots outright, someone's gonna get a chance to win an extra spot. Let's roll it and randomize it. One and a three, four times. One, two, three, and a one. Fourth and final time. After four times, it's Jimmy. Congrats to you. Thanks for grabbing a full spot, an extra spot going your way. All right, now let's gather everybody's names right here. And let's assign you a team. Mark, let me finish these randomizers and then I'll answer your, your address, your issue. Four and a four, eight times for names and teams. I think it's just a glitch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Eight the hard way, there's eight right there. We got Nick down to Chad. Let's actually use this list right here. And then four and a four, eight times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. We got Denver down to San Antonio. All right, so Nick with the Nuggets, Nicholas S with the Mavs, Alan with the Grizz, John with the Pacers, Nancy with the Heat, Aaron with the Nets, Tim with the Raptors, John with the Sixers, Oliver with the Knicks, Chris with the Cavs, Jimmy with the Hornets, Steve with the Kings, Steve S with the Celtics, Jimmy with the Bucks, Kevin with the Jazz, John with the Pelicans, Steve with the Suns, Russell with the Magic, Steve with the Clippers, Kevin with the Wizards, Chad with the Bulls, Daniel with the Pistons, Steve S, Thunder and Timberwolves, Greg with the Rockets, Sean with the Lakers, Kime with the Hawks, Aaron with the Warriors, Michael with the Blazers, and Chad with the Spurs. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Now I'm gonna pause, I'm gonna alphabetize by team. We're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades, and then we'll have that 15 box break, and then at the end of the video, we'll, uh, at the end of the video, we'll give away those slaps. That's gonna be pretty nice. Thanks everybody, I will be right back. Stick around. All right, welcome back, everybody. No deals were done, so let's got the list printed out officially. Let's get it going here on a Tuesday, the twenty third. Appreciate everybody getting in. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna do some of the base heavier stuff first before we get on towards the back with like where where that impeccable is. Um, let's see. What, oh, let me actually do a quick count here. One, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Perfect. All right, let's let's uh, let's look for some Jason Tatum rated rookies out of here. Then we'll work through some of this Leaf stuff, some wild card stuff. Good luck, everybody. Weisskamp. Rejoins the Spurs on a two-year deal worth $4.4 million. And I guess the, the, the Kevin Durant saga is now over. Nets and Durant agree to move forward together. Keith Haslam returning for a 20th season as well. So after all that, I guess everything's good. So now, does that make it more likely or less likely that uh, that Kyrie gets traded? Probably less likely now. I don't know how likely that trade was in the first place. Kyrie wasn't the one 
asking for a trade. He opted in. So it looks like KD, Kyrie, and Ben Simmons will be uh, will be the the core among others in Brooklyn. And looks like that's that. I don't know if uh, does this unlock any big deals. Probably not. I mean, I think the Lakers were really the only ones really pushing, pursuing Kyrie. That might be done. So I think rosters are pretty much set. We're just waiting for some preseason action to start. And we'll, uh, and we'll go from there. All right, 17-18. We got Blake Griffin, 5 out of 10. Nice low number there. That's still Clippers edition. That will go to Steve Birch. Nice low number there. These low number cards do pretty well in the secondary market. Kobe Day tomorrow, 824. There's the rookies, Lonzo Ball. That'll go to the Lakers, Sean H. Rated rookie De'Aaron Fox. And a rated rookie Donovan Mitchell. Does he stay in uh, in Utah or does he get traded? To the Knicks, maybe. It's 001 out of 199. That is for Kevin Benedict and the Jazz. Deer and Fox, of course, will go to the Kings. That'll be Steve Birch. Mm. Redemption for the autograph. That's probably going to be expired. Yeah, it's OG Anaobi for the Raptors. That's from 2019, but we'll still send this to Tim in Toronto. And uh, you might want to... might want to... You might want to still reach out to Panini. They may still do something for you in return on a on this one. To one seventy five, Paul George, OKC. It'll be Steve S. We got a Frank Jackson to 79. Denzel Valentine, Lime Green to 175. Norman Powell to 175. That's for Toronto. Tim with Toronto. Uh, Rex is saying they'll only do points unless it's newly expired. Oh, I'd still reach out to him anyway. Maybe you can twist their arm. All right, we got... 21-22, wild card, Illumination Basketball Edition. All right, let's see what we got here. <laughs> nice, Brandon, thanks. We're even now. All right, let's see what we got here. I always miss it. I don't ever like look up right when I 
Are all these cards numbered? Yeah, I think so. And then we got JD Davidson. That's two out of ten. Oh no, just those few were numbered. Uh, JD Davidson. Uh, is on the Celtics, a second round pick for Boston. That's going to go to Steve S. Tyrese Martin. I like that parallel there. Zaire Williams. 12 out of 60. Jabari Smith. Josh Christopher. 2 out of 12. And we got Justin Minaya to 50. Justin Minaya is undrafted, but I think he played Summer League. With the Hornet, so we'll just send him to Charlotte. Jimmy with the Hornets. Josh Giddy here. Boo Booey. Davion Mitchell. Uh, and a one of one Lester Quinones. Well, where does he go? He is with the Warriors. And that is for Aaron. Aaron, a one of one. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. We got a Max Christie, 43 out of 60. I'm, I'm fairly certain that he is a Laker. Lakers, yes, he bought in. The Lakers bought a. I guess it didn't really. You can do that, but you can buy uh, draft picks, buy a draft spot. So they bought it from a team. And this is who they drafted. Uh, I think they like his shooting stroke. He's going to. I mean, it's a second round pick. He's going to require a little work, Sean Healy, but let's hope that. I hope that it works, does work out for him. There's Zaire Williams. And all these, we'll make sure, our shipping team will make sure these all go to the right place. And Daryl Morcel to 85. I just wanted to get those autographs highlighted right away. And this is, I guess, the, the chase pack. What's in here? Looks like it, and in, yeah, no, just a pack of chase cards right here. What are we doing here? Tyrese Martin to 250, Cole Swider to 250, Jalen Worley to 250, Usman Garuba to 250, Josh Giddy to 250. There's Lester again. Some inserts. A three out of three Josh Giddy for OKC. An autograph to 49. And another card out of seven.
And I think Jeremiah Robinson Earl is also from on OKC, along with Josh Giddy. Nice. So OKC, Steve, you'll get this autograph. And you got a three out of three, Josh Giddy. A rising sun. Nice, and out of fives and under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. That OKC team's gonna look look pretty nice. You'll get that out of 250, Josh Giddy as well, Steve. All right, let's do another one of those boxes. This is the kind of stuff what we're, that we're looking for. I guess it says look for chase packs. I guess not every box has a chase pack. These are some of the different parallels as well. There you go. Wild card, which I believe is a is an old old brand that, that has been revived in recent years. happening here that's to 25 that's Scotty Barnes for Toronto that'll be Tim we've got another rising sun to 99 to Sunmu we've got to 85 Jason Preston and here we have Mikey Williams 30 out of 50 did not get the memo about the signature and has opted to print his name instead Mikey Williams is an American high school basketball player from San Diego. So we will randomize him to one person in the break. Because he's no association with a pro team. So we'll, we'll randomize everybody and the name on top will get this auto. And I guess just put it in a drawer and maybe he turns into... Uh, a hot NBA prospect. And here's a, another Mikey Williams. You know what? We'll put that together with the Mikey Williams pile over here. Luther Muhammad. Yeah, sort of an odd product, right? They're trying to carve their carve a little space in the basketball trading card world. All right, Luther Muhammad is. I think he's still in college. Well, he's with Arizona State now, I think, as a junior. 
All right, so we'll 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 make him. Well, you know what? We're gonna collect all of those together in one lot. So we'll put that all in this in that pile right there. There's Zaire Williams, the seventy-five. He is a, a grizzly, I believe. Yes, he's a grizz. He's from out here too, Lancaster, California. You know, maybe about an hour north of us. That'll be to 75. That it's from Memphis. That's gonna be Alan. Uh, this is why I instinctively thought that this break would probably take an hour <laughs> because of all this sort of extra work here. But we're we'll start speeding up pretty quickly. Is Josiah Jordan James, JD Davidson. I'll mix up these cards here. I'll have to look them all up later. We got a RJ Cole to 99. And he is. In Greece, he signed a contract with the Greek club Lavrio. We'll have to ask Teddy about that when he comes back tomorrow. So we'll put that. We'll also put that in that one big lot. That one is to thirty. A.J. Reeves Jr., Jonathan Kaminga to 20 for the Warriors, Davion Mitchell, 44 out of 50 for the Kings. That's 18 out of 99. That's to 10. Another Mikey Williams to 60. And there's Ayo Dosunmu for the Bulls. That's going to go to Chad Tucker. All right, so that was the wild card. Got some wild cards in here. All right, now let's get into some uh, some leaf stuff. Here's twenty one twenty two pro set seven autographs per box. Look some of these up too. off with Jabari Walker. These are a slightly thicker cardstock too, so maybe a 55 point top loader. Jabari Walker is with Portland. And that will be for Michael P. There's Usman Garuba. Is he for Toronto? My head is. My head is not in. Uh, no, Houston. My head is not in basketball mode at all. All right, that'll be Greg and the Rockets. Late first round pick. We got Josh Minot, power moves. So you can see the slightly thicker card sock there. That acetate, the see-through card, clear card was uh, 
standard top loader. And he is with the Timberwolves, second round pick. Chad Dahl, what do you got for me? Did Jazzy see any of the top five flashbacks? Flashbacks drop yesterday? No, not to my knowledge. We got Bryce McGowan's power moves. And Bryce McGowan's is a Hornet. It's going to go to Jimmy. We got Kendall Brown. Is that a hobby release, Chad? Kendall is with the uh, Pacers. That will be for John, last spot mojo. We got a 72 out of 99 power moves autograph, Johan Traore. Oh yeah, if that's the case, then we probably, we probably did not. Stuff like that, I feel like we usually don't get until it filters back to us through uh, through other channels, but like like our distributors. Still in college? No, uh, as of August 2nd, I guess he's in Israel right now. No, he's still with Auburn. Okay, so that's another college player right here. We're going to put him in that, that college player pile. We'll, we'll randomize all that into one lot. And we got a dual autograph. 5 out of 10, Mikey Williams and Shaden Sharp. We know that Mikey Williams is still in high school. Now that, now that I think about it, I feel like he's going to be one of the bigger college recruits. Whenever, whenever he commits, that might be a big name there. Should work on his autograph first. Shaden Sharp uh, is with the Trailblazers. So we'll do, uh, we'll do a randomizer between whoever gets that pile and Portland. So it'll be whoever wins the lot versus, versus Portland. So that'll be a different dice roll. All right, more leaf. Memories this time. And Shaden Sharp, by the way, seventh overall pick. up is Alan Flanagan. Who is still in college. Alan Flanagan is an American college basketball from according to Wikipedia for the Auburn Tigers. So this will also be part of this college lot. 44 out of 50. Yannick Zosa, or in Zosa.
And he is in... Well, he was drafted by the Wizards. So that'll go to the Wizards. In the 2022 NBA draft. He was uh, previously with uh, a Spanish team and it looks like, yeah, a couple Spanish teams. So he was a 54th, he was the 54th pick. Late second rounder. Let's see if he blossoms into anything. Kevin with the Wizards. We got Blake Wesley. Chilo, what's going on? How are you? 37 out of 99 on the Blake Wesley. And he was drafted 25th overall by the Spurs. That'll be for Chad Tucker and San Antonio. Here you go, CT. We got Usmana Dieng. Who I know was a first round pick as well. He was 11th overall um, for OKC. Thunder could it could could surprise a lot of people really quickly. Steve S with OKC. We got 81 out of 99 Hunter Salas. Hunter Salas is still in college. He's in uh, he's at Gonzaga. So I'll go to that that extra pile right there. Chance Westry. Give peace a chance, Westry. Who is still in in college? Yeah, he's at he's at Auburn. He's at Auburn as well. And finally, we got Zaire Wade. Who is with, uh, he's on a G League team. What was the pro team that he's associated with? Oh, this is uh, Dwayne Wade's kid, that's right. He was selected in the G League draft in 2021 by the Salt Lake City Stars. So yeah, he'll go to the Jazz. That's the Jazz affiliation. But on March 12, 2022, injured list ruled out for the remainder of the year and waived the same day. But the last team that he was associated with was with the Jazz. So Kevin Benedict with Utah. Let's see if he bounces back. All right. Leaf Metal. This is one more Leaf. I, I guess we got some buybacks right here, too. We'll do all the Leaf stuff first. Slab in here as well. All right, so money, Dyson Daniels. Eighteen out of twenty-five. He's with the Pelicans, eighth overall pick. And 
that's going to be for John. We got Andre Corbello. Eight out of twenty. Who is a college basketball player? We'll go in that that pile over here. He's with uh, St. John's. Here is Damian Collins. So money autograph. And he's on Kentucky. It's a Wildcat. I'm gonna put in that big college pile over here. Here's Dwayne Pierce, college and high school. I think he's still in high school, actually. Yeah, he's still in high school, so that'll go into that high school pile. Come on, top loaders. Tumbling all over the place. All right, here we go. Twenty-four out of thirty on that one. Dwayne Pierce still in high school. We'll go in that high school college player pile. There's uh, Adrame Diangue. He's a commit to Washington State, so he's still in high school. We got Alan Flanagan. Did we did we look up Alan Flanagan already? Yeah, he's with Auburn. We got Callan Grady. Helen Grady is with the Denver Nuggets. And Denver, that's Nick Nappy. Nick, this is one out of three. There you go, Kellen. For Nick, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. <laughs> Chad's like, why would he play at Washington State? I don't know, maybe he didn't get any other offers. That's why. Maybe Washington State said, said hey, there's Deja Kelly, 5 out of 20. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll court Queens. We'll put that in the, uh, the high school college pile as well. Uh, she's with uh, North Carolina. And last but not least, there's Zaire Wade again. That'll be for the Jazz. The slammed card is also Alan Flanagan, which is a one of one. That goes in that big pile right there, too. All, all Leaf, all high school Leaf, high school college players in that pile. Let's get this Leaf done, too. There's an automatic Jalen Green in here. All right, let's see what we got. Chat says go to Oregon State instead. If you got an offer at Washington State, you probably got one from Oregon State. 
Maybe, uh, maybe he gets more playing time at Washington State. Maybe he has family near there. I don't know. Chad's a Huskies guy. There's Jalen Green, rookie card, authentic autograph. And well, he was drafted two, right? Yeah. Uh, that's for the Rockets. And we've got uh, this triple right here. So we'll do a randomizer on that between these three teams. This leaf stuff really putting me to work here. Pullman's a terrible place. Now, I, I'm not going to speak for... I've never been to Pullman. So all, all of our Jaspies customers at Pullman, Washington, we still love you. And we appreciate your support. I have nothing bad to say about Pullman. And look at this, we got a James Harden PSA 9. That's pretty cool. 2009 Topps Basketball James Harden rookie card. It's OKC edition. That's a nice one for Steve. All right. Now all that leaf stuff is done. Let's take care of that. Now let's get into some Chronicles. Yeah, also the beard with no beard. All right, this was when Chronicles went landscape mode on this. There's Nicola Batum. And we've got jersey and autograph, Jason Tatum. Nice, 92 out of 199. That's pretty nice. That goes to Steve and the Boston Celtics. 1718 Chronicles, rookie, jersey, and autograph. Nice. Tyler Dorsey goes to the Hawks. It's Frank Jackson to 149. Oh, I thought it was fine. I'm being dramatic, Chilo. There's Cam Birch to 99. DJ Wilson to 249. And Damari Carroll to two ninety nine, and we've got Lakers. Brooke Lopez to ninety nine. That's going to be for Sean. Got Markel Fultz rookie card. Got a blue parallel here. An all-card ship, by the way. All right, what should we do next? Should we, should we get some of these this contenders, a little bit base heavier, contenders out of the way, 2020, 2021 contenders. Yeah, those old chronicles were a little rough. Uh, but you can see what you can see where they were going with it, right? They were they were trying to look uh, chronicles. I think they're trying to go with like a newspapery sort of look. 
Nice idea, but... Oh, way too early to talk about that, Chad. You're even earlier than MLB.com. <laughs> they usually start announcing that in like the sixth inning. I don't think they should be announced until the eighth inning. Way too early. Chad, you probably just jinxed it. He's going to do the Robbie Ray one-inning meltdown. And then it's going to be your fault for the jinx. Vernon Carey Jr., rookie ticket autograph. And that optic... Um, and that optic card stock. And that goes to Jimmy and Charlotte. Oh, did you? Oh, maybe you're a good luck charm then, Chad. Well, let me know what's the eighth inning. And if he's still doing that. We got the final ticket, Marvin Bagley, the third to forty-nine for the Sacramento Kings, Steve Birch. Yeah, I don't I don't I don't care about that sort of thing until the eighth inning. That's fine, you can say it, but I just don't care. <laughs> I won't care until the eighth. I hate when MLB.com announces that sort of thing in like the sixth inning. It's just like, come on, that's, that's way too early. Friends don't have to agree on everything, Chad. To 149. In fact, that's probably what makes us even better friends. There's Jamal Murray to 149. All right, and the redemption. It is Obi Toppin. Nice. Still got some time to redeem it, too. Knicks. That's going to be Oliver and the Knicks. Oliver won a spot in the filler, won a spot in the mixer, got randomized the Knicks. Yeah, you know what? Pullman for life. I'm all, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm a, yeah, Bill Pullman did. I noticed your chat from earlier. That was a good speech from Bill Paul. I'm all, all about Pullman. Bills and the city. Bill Pullman's and the city of Pullman. But I do care about Robbie Ray. He's on my fantasy team. Uh, I've, I've, I've spent I spent years of my life in Pullman, Washington, a wonderful city, a beautiful city, uh, wonderful people. I've never heard one person from Pullman complain about group breaks, complain about not hitting like some other people in that region, in that Washington State region. I've never heard someone from Pullman talk about a no-hitter before the eighth inning. That is not true, Rex. Even I hate it when Tony Gonsolin went five innings, no hit ball or something like that. Did I say anything? Was, I was streaming that night too. Nothing. So wrong again, Rex. Nice try though. All right, there's Josh Christopher. New Year. Those are the exclusive to this set right here. Wasn't so amazing after all. We got you, 
Kaminga, Anthony. Wait, wait, Joe P. really did go to Washington State? No. I didn't. Joe Petrilli from Arizona? I thought he went to school in Arizona somewhere. Maybe he did go to Washington State. Joe P. Wake up. Sometimes he's listening in the background. He's lurking. Joe P. Oh, hmm. Yeah, I'm not. There's Lugan Stewart. And nice Cade Cunningham. There we go. That's for Detroit, Daniel. One of the regulars went to Washington State. I thought so too, Mark. Maybe it was one of the, uh, maybe it was Jimmy? Because he's from that region. He could have conceivably gone to, to that school. Does that ring a bell? Danny Connell or Jimmy Connell? No, wait, you know Jimmy Connell. Yeah, I was going to say no. That's not right. Joe, Joe Pizzle, there he is. We put up the bat signal and here comes Joe Pizzle, the Pizzle signal. Joe P, where'd you go to college? Oh, no college for Joe P. All right, hmm. We thought Chad, someone help us out. Chad Daw is trying to figure out. No, it's all good, all good. Chad thought that you went to Washington State University. And, and Chad's like, man, I swear us, we were talking about Washington State University. And I was like, I don't think Joe went there. If anything, I thought he would have gone to one of the Arizona universities. Actually, let's get, let's do some court kings here. So then who was it? We got Kispert, we got Zaire Williams. And we got a John Collins relic that will be for the Hawks. That's going to be for Kime. Well, hopefully that person. Now I'm curious, Chad. You got you got me thinking. All right, and a Franz Wagner autograph. That's pretty solid. Russell with the Orlando Magic rookie auto, fresh paint auto. to 199. And we got a Josh Giddy first steps insert. Get a look at his kicks. Westbrook. All right, how about some 20 some 1920 Panini Black basketball? See what we got in 2019-2020. Here's a Luka Doncic, 78 out of 149. This will be second year Luka Doncic in this set. That's going to be for Dallas. That'll go to Nicholas. Kyle Kuzma to 149. And R.J. Barrett, nice. Two-color, dual relic, and autograph. An RPA, one out of 49. Oliver with the Knicks. 
G Lo remembers that I was talking about a cheese player the other day drafted out of Washington, and there were like five people from Washington dogging on him. There you go, Freddie Freeman. RBI for him. Yeah, that's uh, that, that's probably Chad and his his crew. There's Chris Middleton for the Bucks. That's gonna go to Jimmy K. 15 out of 49, Buddy Heald. That's still a Kings edition in that year. Now let's get into some choice. Is Rex in the chat? Rex is in the chat. Rex, why do we have a, a, a no-name reliever beaning Albert Pools in the ninth inning? Whoa! Rex, what are your Cubs doing? Why aren't we taking away plate appearances from the machine? Wow. Shame on you, Rex. Shame on Rex. And by proxy, the Cubs. They have pulled up the world. Man. I love Dieter's recurring bit of using the NFL theme when we score seven or more. Right, it's a touchdown? Very good. Yeah, Mark Delar is like, shame on you, Rex. It's obviously Rex called for that beating. Ridiculous. <laughs> he called into the coach and was just like, hey. Hit him. Hit him. Yeah, hit, hit him. Hit Albert here. Hit Albert here. There's Zeke Naji, 10 out of 49. <laughs> Rex says, I, I didn't see it, but I'll agree. Cubs suck. Oh, poor Rex. Now I feel bad. Just a lost season for the Cubs, for Rex and the Cubs. Rex knows how hopeful I am for the Cubs' future. They're, they're going to figure it out. Just get them a couple pitching prospects, and they'll be good. Haven't they, say, haven't they been saying get a couple pitching prospects for, like, years? Yeah, or I mean, you can go sign guys. How crazy! Would I mean, it they be? they sign they signed Strowman. Why don't they sign his former teammate? Why don't they go get Jacob Degrom? Jacob Degrom is a free agent. He is at the end of the year. Yeah. All right, now we got some impeccable basketball here. Oh, that's a fun one. Twenty-one, twenty-two. This is a good way to close out this uh, this big mixer here, and we're giving away stuff too. You know what, Chris, while you're here, can you poke into that cabinet and grab the pile that says Mixer Giveaways yeah, on it? Yeah, of course I can. Put the magics, the cookies. Yeah, oh, oh, yeah. The LeBron's, the Ric Flair's. Oh, yeah. This is what we're giving away at the end. Oh, what a car the LeBron is. So, I know this is... This has been an hour-long break, but well worth the wait because of those four slab cards we're giving away. Everyone has a shot at it. We've got Jamal Murray, eight out of eight. Uh, this must be the Asia edition, right? If we're seeing eight out of eight in red parallels, yeah. yeah. We got Zach Levine. Not numbered, but red parallel. The Jamal Murray, of course, goes to Denver. That's gonna be for Nick. Zach Levine goes to Chad, T, CT, and the Bulls. The plate is Joel Embiid. Red plate, exclusive to this set, not numbered. That will be for John and the Sixers. We got uh, Charles Basie, 53 out of 88. John with the uh, Sixers. Chad calling their shots, saying, <laughs> right. saying the phrase. Ooh. Ooh and a Josh wow. Giddy rookie auto, 8 out of 99. Very nice. Last auto of this mixer, and it's a nice one. Real nice. Steven, Steve S. Stefanik with Oklahoma City bought a spot straight up, got randomized OKC, and ends up with a Josh Giddy on card autograph. Him and Cade look really good in the summer league. Yeah. And they, I mean, they've got a lot of players on that team. They got a lot of players. All right, now let's do some randomizing here. First of all, everyone gets this pile of like, uh, there's, this is just one lot. In case you think it seems like a wow. lot of stuff. It's just leaf high school players and leaf college so you players. Never know. So I mean, yeah, I mean, you're gonna have to hold on to it for a couple of years if you want to see it, uh, see it appreciate. But just FYI, 
decided to put all as one lot. So I gotta randomize this lot, randomize that triple, um, oh, and randomize this too, as well as that. Okay, so I need four lists. Okay, so let's flip back to the list. Let's gather everybody's names. So this first list is gonna be, the first list is gonna be for the lot. The second list um, will be the lot winner versus Portland. That is for that dual autograph card with high school star Mikey Williams and then um, first round pick Shaden Sharp from that Leaf set. The next one is that Leaf triple player one, which will be Philadelphia, Maurice Cheeks, Los Angeles Lakers, Magic Johnson, and Jazz guard Ron Boone. That's the triple. And then the fourth and final one, we'll gather the whole list again, and that is when we'll match you up with a slab giveaway in that order. That's in the description as well. All four of those lists, same dice roll. And it's gonna be four, a three, and one. And one! <laughs> three and a four times. One, two, three, and one. Fourth and final time. So this will be that big high school player lot, high school college player lot. Includes the one of one, Alan Flanagan autograph. And that is for Steve Birch. There you go, Steve. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. For that, so you'll get the, the stack of high school players and college players. So now you're involved here. On the uh, out of 10 dual auto. Same dice roll once again, one and a three, four times. One, two, three, and four. After four times, goes to Portland. Sorry, Steve, uh, but congrats to Michael P. I don't think I called your name too often in the break. But you'll get the dual autograph right here, five out of 10. All right, now. For this triple player card, graded out of eight and a half, graded in eight and a half, four times. Team on top gets it. One, two, three, and four. Goes to the Lakers. That goes to Sean Healy. The random god's doing the right thing on this card. There you go. And now. The slab giveaways. So let's flip back to this list right here. Here's a blank list. Let me gather everyone's names again. All right, so name on top, we'll get the Magic Johnson. The second name, we'll get the Kareem NT. Third name, we'll get the Mosaic Kareem. And then the fourth name, we'll get the LeBron James. After four times, top four, after four, good luck. I think I did that right, right? I think I just copy directly from here, perfect. Good luck everybody, fingers crossed. One, two, three, and four. All right, fingers crossed. Now from five on down, sad times, but I appreciate you getting in. Ooh, Aaron, very close, but no cigar. Thanks for trying, though. Thanks, everybody. Hopefully, we have some nice hits going your way from the break itself. But only the top four can get these slabs. 
The LeBron James slab going to Nancy. There you go, Nancy. I'll show you all the cards in a second. The, uh, the Mosaic Kareem going to number three, Kevin Benedict. The NT Kareem going to Chad Tucker. And the Magic Johnson 1010. The, there's an auto grade and a card grade. 1010 PSA. Steve. Wow. And Steve had okay. See, I feel like Steve Stefanik. When it rains, it pours, man. I think he had a really nice break, I'm pretty sure. And you get that card right there as well. Congrats to the top four. Thanks, everyone, for making this happen. Here's a look. So, Steve, this Magic Johnson going your way. The NT Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, 9-9, nine, nine, will be going to Kevin. That's pretty sharp. Uh, to Chad Tucker, that is, sorry. And this one is for you, Kevin. This Kareem is for you. The 1010 -10 from Mosaic. And Nancy with the Cleveland LeBron James graded a 9.5. Centering corners a 9.5, edges a 9.5, surface a 9. Thanks, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Some nice slabs going your way. Hopefully some nice hits going your way as well. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with me. I'm Joe, and I'll see you next time for the next basketball break. Bye-bye.